is my story before we put the index This is when things get a little more in depth Read it through, believe it's true This is all I needed to leave a new path to a cleaner view Welcome to Behind the Bars 6, we got a sick battle, make some noise! Yeah. <laughs> On my left, coming from Leeds, we have Pete Soldier, make some yeah. noise! Yeah. Yeah. Fucking massive! Get <laughs> <laughs> him right! Get right! <laughs> On my right, we have, coming from Merseyside, it's G Double E! The robot He's after the battle. Tiny. <laughs> <Not even scouts. laughs> Widow, wankers. <laughs> Widow. Right. Anyway, so we've decided the peace soldier is going to go first. So, man, when you're ready. Hey, you fella, come Sorry. all the way to Warrington for this. Sorry. <laughs> you got me looking like a giant for a whole two battles now. <laughs> I mean, why don't you give me someone taller like Taipara or Nulo? But instead, you got me battling a Scouse version of Willow. <laughs> you little fucking cretin. To be honest, you look like someone that I've stepped in. <laughs> I'm about the same as my son and he's seven. <laughs> and with that swag, you're about a cunt air away from being in one direction. <laughs> Your mind frame should be fuck hip hop. You look like you should have been in a boy band, bitch. GWE is the kind of guy to say, I'm not gay, I just love dick. <laughs> and I've got a thing for Pex and I hate tits. I'm a black man going on sick in a room full of white people. Woo! Calling niggas the Django. I'll slap all sides of your face at the same damn time. We call that the tango. <laughs> your girl's got a scouse brow, skin tone, tango. And we nickname her Pussy Fruit, because that's one place you'll let this mango. <laughs> Like a nigga with a foot fetish. <laughs> All you tasting is defeat. Wrapped in white Facebook page. His way is beating off his meat. He got invited to Dope Flop. Then Chronicle started powering this geek. He'd follow with Velo into a fire. That's why I'm carving up this sheep. Nice. His face goes red raw when he spits. Feels like I'm barring with a peach. <laughs> and you've just been saved by the bell. Shit. Feels like I've been powering it with screech. Oh, yeah. Let's go, make some noise! Yeah. Yo, first round, do I wanted Nero. And they all wanted Sean O'Mac. But no, I got Method Man. His first part will be. You know black, why Joe rap? <laughs> and I'll fucking stand there and talk real fast. Irrelevant words to make up a sentence and the ending is always gonna be the same. Your mum is a slag. <laughs> I seen his mum in Oxfam buying your socks, man. <laughs> I seen his dad. Wait there, do you know your dad? No. Nah, I didn't think you would, because your mum's a slag. <laughs> anyway, I seen some man Buying him a PlayStation 1 for his birthday, lad. I mean, he says he reps Gucci. You're just a tall, ugly tramp. How could you ever think you were making me? You look like the tall guy in diversity. He looks like Anton Ferdinand if he was in a German band. You look like Carlson Cole if he was on the dome. And I can't even believe you rap at all. You look like you'd excel so much more at basketball. You're fucking tall as shit. Something like A44 and shit. His mum smells like one pound fish in between her lips. Mackies and chips cause she's fat as shit. And you rap with a weird accent, it needs a replay. Every round I'm like, yo, what did he say? Sound like a Yorkshire version of DK. <laughs> but you're a dickhead. You're not like a pussy that raps. You're so pussy, the P before soldier stands for pussy flaps. <laughs> That's what soldier boy tell him. I'll take Davey for that one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. right. And your mum is a dick hound. She loves dick real bad. She's been banned from Leeds. Hull, Huddersfield, Sheffield, all the way back to Brad. Your dad is the Yorkshire Ripper. <laughs> and your ma 
is the Yorkshire Stripper! <laughs> <laughs> time! Time! Let's go! Second round with P Soldier! <laughs> <laughs> Lock into my belly button when I'm speaking. <laughs> I mean, if this were really beef, I'd have thrown you in a Boston crab and spoiled the way you walk. Or maybe give you a choke slam and spoiled the way you talk. But I think we should rename GWE Circumcision. Because we all know this ain't the first time that he's coming up short. Ooh. I mean, my goal is to reveal your skeleton like you just took a shot from Blanca. <laughs> Fucking hell. Rockside, you want, you want technical? Oh, check me out now. You little <laughs> dumb fuck. <laughs> if you tried to fight me, the way she could do is throw his damn headbutt. And I'm not Matarazzi, so there's no way you can play me. If you want to mix fighting with football, I'll turn mad. And headbutt you like Fellaini? Nice. I mean, I don't support Chelsea, so your dead shots one matter. I've got heart like Joe Coles, get hot when I'm preaching. You're Jamie Carragher in Aaron Lennon's body, a Scouse accent in the frame of a weakling. <laughs> I mean, my arsenal leads to Spurs, get your head top crack like a toffee, because my bars cause pain like a Rooney shot from range. A man will stuff you in them baggies because we roll with them pompies. Pure black cats watching you gaff like owls. Man, you should have never accepted this battle, because I smoked so much weed I could roll with the potters, and you chill with the faggots. That's why you sniff up the poppers. Nice. <laughs> nice. Yeah. <laughs> right. His life, one constant drama. Americanized rapper, aren't ya? <laughs> Lives in Leeds, so he's angry at the fact he couldn't register his vote for Obama. <laughs> And your battle against Rebel Mind State was shit not great. With all that chitter chatter. Your third round was you standing there going, I'm an adult with the motto. And <laughs> <laughs> then adult with the motto. <laughs> you had cornrows. You still got them, because you thought they fly. But the gaps in between them look like a row of water slides. <laughs> And I don't even care what you say. I might be small, you're tall, but you're gay. <laughs> I might look into your belly button, but you're a lamb mutton. I'll shut him when I bust him in his hip and dislodge his leg when he's walking. <laughs> you fucking wanker. <laughs> and you mention blanker. I don't give a fuck. Rhythm is a dancer. <laughs> Time. So, third and final round for Peace Soldier. Hold it down. When it came to dissing Glenn Macker, I had no time to waste, man. Because Glenn Macker's more waste than day three ways waste band. <laughs> and you'd need about 60 yellow pages just to get up in my face, man. And I threw my balls over your mum's eyes when she asked me for some ray bands. <laughs> yet again, I'm having to prove that I'm the better rapper. I use that scheme against Rebel Mind State, but today it's aimed at Glenn Macker. You dumb fucking spacker. If your face were covered in air, you'd probably look like Chewbacca. <laughs> and from the size of them lungs, I know little Glenn can't smoke. At first I was gonna play Mr. Nice Guy, but your smart ass Facebook status is turn my mind frame row or more. I mean, you have had a few battles, but what have you actually done? Okay, you took you fresh on the scene. Ivella practically gave you three points in your battle with Substance. <laughs> you battled Nulo in your back garden, and Dave Freeways gave you that work. <laughs> so how the fuck have you got the cheat to go on like some kind of diva? Because if you ask me, I think your style's kind of moist like a turned on beaver. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, everything you say is absolute bollocks. All you do is just stand there and be like, dickhead, wanker, your mum's a slag. No oh shit, did you just mention Blanca? <laughs> <laughs> because you forget.
get your bars and that is a constant thing that you do in your battles and you're about the same height as a baby so you belong in a push chair holding a fucking rattle. Right. Time. Time. It's good. Third and final round, GWA. Yo, it's Monotone Soldier. We ain't got no P. Every round's like putting a shelter here, listening to C. <laughs> <laughs> All sounds the same. Your bars are just lame. I'm fly, your plane. There won't be a rematch. I can't see a game. And for my third, I'm gonna make a statement. Fuck you and your rap battle placement To me you're a nice meal on my plate, bitch I can see in your face your confidence breaking So stop black, because you league, this place is taken And I don't give a fuck what you say Or what in your right I come with bars to prove I can say them With the flow and style and technique you couldn't ever write And after tonight, you'll seriously think about your life You'll go home and type a status saying I don't know if battling's right Cause I'll end your career when I spat out my rhymes I'll make you feel like a cokehead Who's depressed off the white Make you doubt yourself after a few lines I'm Charles Dickens The way I'll have a twist I'll quote Tupac And that's why you wonder why they call you a bitch yeah, You nice. couldn't write a scheme You're far too dull and thick So I suppose his flows are like my fucking dick <laughs> Cause they're dull It's quite thick as shit <laughs> So this path of life you need to make a change You're in the wrong lane a new vs rebel was shit not great The only reason you look good is cause your opponent was lame And I know most of my battles have one of the same But I'm here to prove that I'm big in the game I don't know yet, you're probably safe But for accepting this battle you're fucked in the brain Because, are you a coroner? You just agreed to sign your own autopsy by agreeing to face GWE after defeat Cause I got a fucking point to make mm. It's either bars over jokes, jokes over bars I don't really care cause I'll decline your progress like no funds on your card I'll put a bomb under the car like the IRA again but I'm not in Omar But this time a bombing in Warrington will blow up this bitch until his body bag is filled up with soldiers body parts You just hate bars don't you? <laughs> anyway, right? I'll fucking split your wig like a fanny pot <laughs> I filmed your mum doing a fanny fart! <laughs> I'll spit in your face like a poison dart! And as your health deteriorates, I'll get a doctor to tell you you were fucked from the start. <laughs> and you smell a B.O. Really fucking bad, so I guess you were nervous. And is that body warmer from Afghan? Is it army surplus? <laughs> <laughs> I can't even believe you're wearing that shit. I'm in chinos and you still look like a dick. <laughs> Purple sleeves, orange zip. <laughs> what the fuck is going on with that shit? <laughs> you got a snapback? Probably likes Tupac, but has a biggie poster in his flat. <laughs> fucking bars that he spat, calling Rebel a Polak. But if I mentioned anything about him being black, I'd get hated for that. Nice. What the fuck, man? Suck your mum, man. <laughs> <laughs> I hate the fact your rounds seem to drag. I hate the fact your mum is a slag <laughs> I hate the fact your sister's a skate, your bed's quite fit Your dad is a cunt And your nan is a tramp <laughs> Time Time! <laughs> Let's go to the um, To be honest, like, it, was, it was a funny battle uh, GWE fuck up in his second I had GWE winning the first round Although Peace Soldier was really good in it Peace Soldier at the second round, GWE fuck it up and it's just a whole like, depending on where you are, bars over jokes, jokes over bars, and obviously GW is better at jokes than he has bars, and it didn't, it fell a little bit flat. Um, P Soldier was strong in the third round again, and he, he did have like the funniest thing when he said talking to my belly button, it really cracked me away, it was good. Um, I give it to P Soldier. Yeah, I mean, basically what Sprung said really. Um, very funny battle. I would have given the first to G, um, but then uh, second and third, it's kind of ironic that GW sort of said that you, 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 your rounds sort of meander and go on a bit, when I think that basically that's the criticism if you're able to get for rounds two and three. You should have just sort of tripped them back a bit, given it a little bit, a little bit of a pruning, but you know, Peace Soldier is strong throughout, so I've got to give it two to, two to one to him as well. Uh, GW first round. Um, in the second round, the second round, 
piece holders on that. Um, I'm going to give Ferrari to Gino away, just based on he kept on going. So I think he spat more than that round, so yeah, I'm going to on Do you know what spat more eyes with? Yeah, yeah. Cash more! <laughs> Boom! It sort of does. <laughs> Welcome back to Behind the Bar 6, we just had a sick bow, make some noise! Yeah. Big Jasper Bear Beats on the Globin. We had a winner of two to one.